Uh, my name is Taebon Park from South Korea. I'm majoring in auto repairs at Lake Washington Institute of Technology. I'm on track to graduate on June 2018. You know, my father was a mechanic in South Korea, so it's been lifelong passion. I'm really, really satisfied with my program. The instructors are really close and friendly and passionate. They also give me a chance to learn not only the theory and knowledge of the car repair, but also to put into real practice. So I like program a lot. My goal is really specific. The first one is to get ASC certification when I graduate this program. And after that, I want to work at really, really big dealership like Toyota, Hyundai. And after that, I want to own my general mechanic shop with like three or four team members. There are 240 million cars in the US and the more than billion cars all over the world. That means there are a lot of work to be done. It is why I chose this field and decided to become a mechanic. I have language burial because I'm not a native of English. I'm also taking English as a second language courses at Lake Washington. I received a Bright Future scholarship by uh, Ford and then Hyundai of Kirkland and the Porsche Club of Northwest. You know, the college tuition is really expensive, so this scholarship reduced my financial burden and scholarship also help buying my tools. You know, as people already know, the mechanic tools are really expensive. I really, really appreciate it for Hyundai of Kirkland about your you guys' generosity. It really, really helpful. I also really thankful the Porsche Club. You guys were really kind to me and you guys gave such a really big chances to focus on my academic too. Thank you for your support. 감사합니다. I am Alfredo Sanchez in the dental hygiene program at Lake Washington. So I've been doing dental assisting for about 10 years now and I uh, decided to take the next step in my career and become a dental hygienist. So I enrolled here at Lake Washington to do that program. I'll be graduating with a bachelor's degree in, in dental hygiene in June of 2018. The, the total program itself, I believe it's like 25,000 or so. Usually when you first start up, you have to, it's probably about 10,000 to start up, uh, buying all the equipment and the tools. and The dental kit uh, that we have to purchase is uh, pretty expensive and it's a must have to succeed in the, in the field. The way I pay for the program is through uh, student loans and uh, working through the weekends. Essentially, I work two jobs. Um, one of them is caregiving for a, a relative, and then the other is uh, working as a dental assistant in, on the weekends, or days off from the program. I work in a dental clinic in Linwood. The dentist really liked me as a dental assistant, so he's excited about me becoming a dental hygienist and is offering me a job as a hygienist in his practice. Personally, I like the uh, restorative side of being a dental hygienist. Uh, I was already doing that as a dental assistant, but I think as a dental hygienist, I'm able to apply more skills into the office, be able to get people numb now, do the restorative side, and also be able to clean their teeth. I received the Frost Family Dentistry Scholarship. This scholarship for me is gonna help lessen the burden of trying to pay for tuition or paying for any exams, dental exams that are coming up shortly. Uh, there's quite a few of them. Uh, I think the total cost is about maybe about $2,000 um, to get all the certifications and licensures. The scholarship is gonna go a long way for me and I wanna say thank you. I'm Selena McClinton and I am in the pre-nursing program. I graduated with my medical assisting degree in 2013 from Lake Washington. 
Now I'm working as a medical assistant at Overlake Hospital and I work in the primary care clinic. I'm in school full time and I work full time. When I started at Lake Washington Tech, I was in foster care and the family that I live with wanted me to take advantage of the Running Start program here. And so I finished my high school and I also got some college credits. And then um, after that, I didn't really know what I wanted to do. I decided to come back to Lake Washington for the medical assisting program. I graduated from medical assisting and I feel confident that I can take on the next level of education. My ultimate goal, I would like to continue my education and become a nurse practitioner or a physician assistant. So I received the key scholarship from um, Dr. Ed and Pam. The scholarship gave me the confidence to um, continue on in the nursing program. I received the scholarship when I first started my prereqs for the nursing program. My first quarter I knew was covered for the scholarship and then Ed and Pam told me that they wanted to extend the scholarship to my next quarter. My next quarter came and then they wanted to extend it for the rest of my nursing career. So the scholarship will follow me all the way through the nursing program. It was such a blessing to have people that really, really believe in me. To know that Ed and Pam are behind me, um, it's hard to put into words. I mean, it's, it's two people who don't really know me. For them to just right away say, I believe in you, I'm going to invest in your education. To know that they're there for me is amazing, especially when you, you desire that support from your own family. Ed and Pam have definitely become like family. I am so grateful and so thankful for their generosity, helping me to um, see my potential. They've, they've done a lot for me, so I would just say thank you.